on YouTube. Um, I'm actually giving you a video today, second video of the day, assuming that my internet and my everything wants to upload and my kind master wants to work. So hopefully today, second video. This one's actually requested by a subscriber who messaged me on Xbox and had a question about guilds um, and how basically you change the wording, how you add pictures and whatnot. So this is just a general like how do you do it, what can be done on, and where you, where you can do it. So you'll notice, for example, if I go to guild listing, you'll see this weird blocky text. And obviously, um, it doesn't look like this, because this would be a very weird guild description and guild headline. But, say, I'm going to link it here. Link it into a channel. All right, we'll link it to that one. So say I were to link it, it would pop up as this. So you see the text is different color and there's actually two pictures. So the question is, is basically how do you do that? Can you do that on Xbox and PS4 and PC? PC always has it easy, it's super easy to do. You can just copy and paste. Unfortunately for us Xbox users, we have to actually punch these codes in. And so there's two, basically they're, they're slightly different. Um, so let's talk about color first, because color is easy. So this one up here is just a color tag. Um, the way you can tell it's color and not anything else is because there's an R and not a T at the end. That's basically it. But say I were to change this text here, so everything from R or from A, so A social to peeps, is all just part of this little line of color. If I were to take this line and then copy it over, I could like to the left of it or to the right of it, I could put a new color code in and then I could change the color word in. Or say I ended, I turned this and I put this dash R over to the left. After returning, then peeps would go back to being white. So then the real big question is, is okay, so how do I get this? And it's actually super simple. Um, I'll link this website and I'll put a picture of it on screen. Basically, you just select the color wheel you want and it tells you right what you need to put in. And then bada bing, bada boom, that's it. You just write it in verbatim. Um, you literally just highlight the text and then click apply and then at the bottom it'll even put the text that you can put in but I'll tell you also right now you can edit that text because um, obviously you'll see that I have test in but and then you'll see it says test I'll put test twice test test so you can see that this is the color scheme that it wants you to use this is how it is but if you were to change the wording spaces anything like that as long as it's between this symbol right here on your Xbox then you're good. And then the N symbol and then the R. Boom, that's color. You can change the color. This little color wheel, same thing. I'll do that right here. I'll show you what it would look like with a different color. Boom, same thing. This is where it gets a little more intricate. So this is a big old word. And this is actually from another website called, let's see if I get the name here for you, ESOUI add-on wiki. So basically the beautiful developers have encoded pictures of everything and basically you can pull from their picture list which is massive mind you and you can put it into your guild thing so this is actually a map of Cold Harbor um, so everything from art all the way over to DDS is just them pulling from the photo library of where it is now you might be wondering what the 32 the 32 is and so we're actually going to go to a different example to show you what that 32 and that 32 is so we're going to go to wrong place actually you could so funny example is you can also put pictures as you can see over your names and i just put a big old flag over mine just to you know just because i thought it was funny um so i'm going to change about us so here you'll see this banner so you can see the banner at the bottom next to contests now, basically what that banner is, is this, this 50-60. So one is the vertical, and one is the horizontal. So where it's written, so you see how it's written after the word contests. So that's where it's going to pop up. And now, say I were to change this to 80, you can see how it'll be affected. Except, see now it goes up. If I were to change the number on the left, it would go left-right. It would get wider. I'm actually going to put that back. Basically, all I mean, all of this is, and unfortunately, there's not a super easy way to like tell exactly what it's going to look like until you've put it in. Um, but there's a whole bunch of really cool pictures and stuff you can use. Um, I just kind of experiment. Unfortunately, like, and I'll have the website linked, and I'll put even another picture of it so you can see kind of what we're working with. That hard to tell what the pictures look like off the top of your hand. Like, if you look at the word Nexus Scavenger, 
that's actually just um, a picture of it's called candy on ESO I don't even know I just thought it looked neat um, so that's kind of what we're working with uh, but yeah this is really all you need to do you can have multiple colors you can see other guilds that have like multiple colors same concept um, most people don't have pictures because they're a little more difficult but I think 32 32 I think is generally the picture frame requirement for it to be kind of like equal between all the lines and equal width like make it a nice square so I recommend 32 32 um, as you can see from the link to brick squad so if you want to put some of that in boom you'll see the two different maps of Cold Harbor um, other than that if you have any questions just let me know I'll make sure to reply if you have any issues with it just let me know um, if not, uh, I will catch you guys in the next one. Just let me know what video you guys want to see next because this was recommended by one of you and I wanted to research it and show it to you guys. So whatever you guys want next, just let me know and I will catch you in the next one. Peace.